Another bailout deal could be on the way for Greece, this time with no strings attached. Greek finance minister Yanis Stornaris has called on the rest of the eurozone for another long-term loan, one without fresh austerity measures because current targets are in place until 2016. And German finance minister Wolfgang Schäuble said earlier this month Greece may need another bailout if it wants to balance its books. The country's first bailout came after years of cheap lending and a soaring national debt that crippled its economy. International lenders have sent Greece more than $320 billion in loans since 2010. The International Monetary Fund estimates it would need a third bailout worth about $13 billion, far less than its first two payments. Now in its sixth year of recession, Greece still isn't on track to full recovery. Spending is more or less under control, but revenue collection is lagging behind because of delays in reforming the tax administration and pursuing wealthy tax evaders through the courts. This comes about a month before Germans head to the polls to decide the fate of Chancellor Angela Merkel's re-election bid. Germany is the eurozone's biggest economy, and the idea of shouldering the burden for another Greek bailout is again unpopular with voters. Merkel has tried to avoid the topic in the campaign, but her challenger, Pierre Steinbrück, has accused her of misleading voters when it comes to writing down more debt. He told a German newspaper, rescuing Europe and holding the continent together will cost something. It will cost us Germans, too. Inspectors from the EU and IMF will visit Greece next month to review bailout conditions. For Newsy, I'm Elizabeth Hagedorn.